Georgia in blue. There's no score yet, and we've just missed the first half a minute. Rene just looking for a grip from which he can work. Matthias Vili, about the same thing. They've been on together before. That's not an entirely unknown quantity for Rene. Both fighters have picked up a sheet of a piece as they put a cake around looking for a grip. Minute and a half left to go. Shido apiece, no score yet. Rene and Matthias Vili. Rene looking to go over on the right side there. Can't get his feet in the right position to push his hip through. That was what he had in mind. That's more passivity. which Irakli Uznadze finds laughable. Well, the crowd unhappy with it as well. They want the, the, fa they fancy the underdog, don't they? Cause an upset. He comes in for Cernaghi and now Rene begins to come up with a couple of attacks just to make sure that he doesn't pick up another penalty. Half a minute left, or just a little bit under that. I think he was leading. <laughs> the French coach. Well, not leading, but he has the advantage, having only collected one penalty. As a
Well, the crowd are demonstrating their unhappiness at that result. It's more a question of, you know, they would have cheered Rinner out of the stadium had he thrown in for Ippon, you know. But, you know, it, it's not easy for him because there is a, there is a lot of tactics involved when fighters attempt to face Rinne and I've got some sympathy on the crowd didn't boo any other, anyone else who won in that fashion but I suppose their expectations for Rinne are so high and right at the end Matthias Vili was disappearing off the map when Rinne just pulled him down for Ripon to one well you know it was there was still time left on the clock so Rinne was perfectly within his rights to throw him Matthias really was walking away because there were only